Management Controls, ITGC, your guardians of system stability. Imagine your IT system as a complex machine, constantly humming with information processing. Even the smoothest machine needs occasional tweaking and updates, but just like wrenching on a delicate watch requires care, so too does changing your IT landscape. Enter Change Management Controls, ITGC, the meticulous technicians ensuring your system evolves smoothly and securely. What are change management controls? There are a set of policies and procedures governing how changes are implemented within your IT systems. Think of them as traffic lights and stop signs for updates and modifications, ensuring everything flows safely and efficiently. These controls cover the entire life cycle of a change, from initial proposal to final implementation and monitoring. Why are they important? Uncontrolled changes are like rogue bolts in your machine, potentially causing crashes, data loss, and security vulnerabilities. Change management controls act as gatekeepers, ensuring system stability, minimizing disruptions and unexpected consequences of changes, reduced risk, identifying and mitigating potential security threats introduced by new configurations, compliance, aligning changes with relevant regulations and internal policies, efficiency, streamlining the change process, saving time and resources. Key Features of Change Management Controls Formal change request process, every modification, big or small, needs a documented proposal outlining its purpose, impact, and potential risks. Review and approval, a dedicated team assesses proposed changes, weighing their benefits against potential downsides before granting approval. Testing and validation, before rolling out a change to the entire system, it undergoes rigorous testing in a controlled environment, identifying and fixing any glitches. Documentation and rollback plan. Detailed records of every change are maintained, including a clear rollback plan to revert if necessary. Monitoring and communication. Continuously monitoring the system after a change to identify any unintended effects and keeping stakeholders informed. A full to illustrate how change management controls work in practice. Scenario. A bank plans to upgrade its online banking system to a new version with enhanced features and security. Change management controls in action. 1. Formal change request process. The IT team initiates a change request, detailing the reasons for the upgrade, expected benefits, potential risks, and a proposed implementation plan. The request is reviewed and approved by a change advisory board, CAB, consisting of representatives from various stakeholders, including IT, security, business operations, and compliance. 2. Review and approval. The CAB carefully assesses the change request, evaluating its impact on system stability, security, compliance, and user experience. They may request additional information or suggest modifications to the plan to mitigate risks. Once satisfied, they grant formal approval to proceed with the change. 3. Testing and validation. The new version of the online banking system is thoroughly tested in a controlled environment, e.g., a testing lab, before being deployed to production. This testing involves functional testing to ensure all features work as expected. Performance testing to ensure it can handle expected user load. Security testing to identify and address vulnerabilities. User acceptance testing to gather feedback from a small group of users. 4. Documentation and rollback plan. All change-related documentation is meticulously maintained, including change request forms. Testing results. Approvals from CAB. Implementation plans. A clear rollback plan is created, detailing steps to revert to the previous version if unexpected issues arise during or after implementation. 5. Monitoring and communication. After the upgrade is rolled out, the IT team closely monitors the system for any performance issues, security incidents, or negative user feedback. They proactively communicate any changes or potential impacts to users and stakeholders, keeping them informed and prepared. Risk. Potential disruptions and security vulnerabilities are identified and addressed before affecting live systems. Improved stability. Testing and monitoring ensure the system remains stable and functional after the upgrade. Enhanced compliance. The bank can demonstrate adherence to regulatory requirements for change management. Better user experience. Smoother transitions and proactive communication minimize disruptions for users. Increased efficiency. Clear processes and documentation streamline change management activities, saving time and resources.